Hi, I'm Dr. Seiya Tsujimura, Associate Professor at Bioelectrochemistry Laboratory. Our team's activity focuses on bioelectrochemistry, developing porous carbon materials and redox materials, whose applications include analytical chemistry with biological sensors, bioreactors, electrochemical biomimetic system, energy conversion, and biofuel cell. We use redox enzymes and microbial cells as an electrocatalyst, where their redox activities can be electrochemically controlled. Regarding enzyme-based electrochemistry, we study the electron transfer reactions of redox enzymes on the electrode surface and the interactions between the enzyme and electrode. We have gained a significant reputation for developing innovative immobilization strategies for bioredox molecules involving redox hydrogel technology with porous materials. A remarkable achievement of such immobilization principles is based on functional polymers and three-dimensional nanostructured electrode materials like functionalized carbon nanotube meso-macroporous carbon material intercalated with biological, organic, inorganic objects. We are interested in how an exceptional nano-environment around the enzyme in the nano-confined space enhances the enzyme's durability and electron transfer rate. Besides our expertise in synthesizing functional redox materials and modifying nanostructured supports for immobilizing biomolecules, we are highly experienced in electrochemical biosensing and the biological conversion of energy. Thanks to the enzyme's reaction selectivity, we can develop electrochemical biosensors. In particular, we focus on sensors that can measure blood glucose with high accuracy. Biofuel cells are devices for directly converting the biochemical energy of sugars, organic acids, and alcohols into electrical energy using a redox enzyme as an electrocatalyst. Biofuel cells have received considerable attention as sustainable clean energy devices, especially for the energy demands of wearable applications. We also developed a novel self-powered biosensor system based on biofuel cell technology. Hi, I am Hossein M. Motar from Bangladesh, a doctoral student. NGM electrochemistry is a powerful tool for coupling oxidoreductase enzyme to the electrode reaction to flow of electrons. An immobilized enzyme electrode is required for continuous glucose sensor and biofuel cell. I am focusing on advanced immobilization techniques and novel materials to employ the continuous monitoring of glucose. Professor Sujimura Laboratory gives us a diverse and multicultural environment to make a new ideas and techniques for creating a sensor device. Please join with us. We study the interaction between microorganisms with electrodes, which is known as microbial electrochemistry. The microorganisms we are interested in are called electroactive as they can perform an extracellular electron transfer. This knowledge could be applied to enhance the electron transfer to or from electrodes to understand some processes like corrosion, microbial metabolism and growth and also to build biosensors, bioremediation systems, wastewater treatment processes, electrocatalysis and energy production systems. My name is Silvia Sato Soto. I'm an international PhD student from Peru. In the Bioelectrochemistry Laboratory, my research topic focuses on the modification of carbon-based electrodes with certain redox mediators and its interaction with a certain microorganism that is called Shewanella onaidensis. This bacterium can perform an extracellular electron transfer and generate some electric current within bioelectrochemical systems that are called microbial fuel cells. The final goal is to enhance this electron transfer between Shewanella and the electrons. Bioelectrochemistry, electrocatalysis, will play a key role in manufacturing beneficial and environmentally benign molecules, sustainable materials, or clean energy. 
bio electrocatalysis should also drive progress in the emerging field of sustainable catalysis, where electroenzymatic synthesis happens in aqueous media. Furthermore, electrocatalysis will also be accelerated by the development of new multidisciplinary approaches. We look forward to working with those who are interested in bioelectrochemistry and the future of bioelectronics. Our graduates are employed in a wide range of fields, 